right so this is my kitty cat teddy he is now 20 years old he was doing great until he recently went in and had his teeth cleaned for the first time ever <laughs> and we want to do that because he also had a mass big bubble like a mass under his eye and they didn't want to just give him the surgery put him under for kind of like one thing so they um they said when we just, you know when they put him under they could do his teeth too so was, yeah check out his mouth the old cat make sure things are okay in there and then kind of like ever since that he's had uh, a bout of GI issues and uh, he's getting better little by little because he was actually even hiding in the hiding in their closet stuff like that hiding in the closet away from people he's been up on his perch now but now he's come down when he sees the brush because he loves the brush so now him's coming down he is he is he coming down for the brush um, still has GI issues. He is getting a kidney kidney care diet because his kidney values are up. Um, what else is he doing? Uh, we're also giving him fluids. Uh, we were started every other day, but the next blood test showed that he needed um, his kidney values were still high, so we needed to give him fluids. So I'll show you in a second here. That is his kitty perch that is six foot high and he likes to hang around up there and we keep the IV bag hanging up there and then we sit on the couch and give him his fluids uh, at night but it's it's nice to see him come down again for brushing so this is the morning I've got my morning coffee here and my my Kitty cat, that's my tuxedo kitty cat. That's my teddy. Found this at the thrift store at uh, Goodwill. And then I have my orange cat. Looks like Rudy too, too. I have a video on with him riding on top of the, uh, like the Roomba Nido kind of vacuum cleaners in a box. He really loved it. He passed away in uh, June. And, uh. And then I got my pictures of my Wooster right there. And you see my Wooster and Levi. Two of my babies. And that's Wooster and Daisy in the snow. And that's Bentley laying there on the floor. And then I think Daisy's over here on the side of me. There's my Daisy Dukes kind of in a corner. There she is. So down to three. And it's very weird only having three. We used to have it. One time we had six cats and two dogs. And then we had three dogs and five cats. And now just down to two dogs, Bentley and Daisy. And they are... They just turned 12, and Teddy, and he is 20, and no more, no more until we move or until Bentley passes, because Bentley, he really doesn't like other pets around him. He doesn't like, uh, like he'll pick a fight with them if they get too close, and that's not fun. And Daisy and Bentley are litter mates, and Daisy's not like that at all. She likes she likes people. She likes other animals. She likes the cats, which was important since we had five at the time. I mean, Bentley had, yeah, when we brought the puppies in, we had five cats at the time. And he was fine with them when they were kittens, but as he grew, he decided he didn't like them. So, well, it is a Friday. See, he's licking his paws. He kind of licks his paws. A little raw so we know that something's something's still not feeling great on him right teddy bear I like my beagle pants <laughs> my beagle pants my, my house lounging pants I've got to uh, I gotta still well, get redressed I got out of my jammas and got into these lounging clothes 
But I do have to run to the, um, I got to go get some gas today for the mower and for the power washer. And probably hit the gym. And I want to stop it. I think uh, the dollar store s sells that awesome stuff. That awesome does clean up the the railings and stuff pretty nice. And I'm all out of that. So I'm going to go get some awesome. So we're going to do some odds and ends. Odds and ends when I decide to leave the house. When uh, my during COVID and when Wooster, my dog Wooster, uh, he was going through bladder cancer and then lymphoma. I was home for almost three years. I, I could count the amount of time on my on a hand, <laughs> two hands, that I left the house. My girlfriends were wonderful. They would come over um, to the house with me and, and visit with me here. And I got out when I brought Wooster to the vet and stuff like that. But if he was here, I was here. And that's exactly where I wanted to be. You know, hubby was still working and working from home and we we're doing stuff from home. So it was, it was good. It was good to be able to be home with him. He lasted much longer than we thought he was going to last. I'm grateful of that. But it's been just over a year. April 30 passed. So... And then Rudy in June. So it's been tough. Now I want Teddy to last for more years. You know, cats can live to 27 years. Or longer. Obviously some a lot sh shorter, depending on what they get. But we're hoping to pull him through this. Get his kidney values down again. That's the hope. So that's it. It's so quiet here. It's just a beautiful, overcast, beautiful, overcast, quiet day. Yep, got to get some gas for the mower because the grass is getting long again. Got to get the stuff for the power washer so I can get the back furniture and everything cleaned up. Turn on the irrigation well, pump well, so that I can hose off. Hose off what I'm doing and to use the power washer. So that's it. There's my huffing and puffing Daisy Dukes. So she had her breakfast. Bentley usually doesn't eat breakfast. Sometimes he eats breakfast. Most of the time he doesn't. Oh, my teddy bears. All right, that's it. That's it. Just sitting here enjoying. Enjoying Teddy on my lap. He sat on my lap actually last night for when I had my John Holland thing. It was nice. He came down here and because he wasn't doing that. He wasn't sitting on my lap. He didn't want to be touched. So he's feeling a little bit better. Yep, feeling a little better. <laughs>